Yo, what's going on guys? It's Cynical and today I thought I'd bring you guys a discussion video talking about Tarzan and his involvement with the Kingdom Hearts franchise. As many of you know, Tarzan appeared in Kingdom Hearts 1 back in 2002. The inclusion of Tarzan was an entire world known as Deep Jungle. Now, ever since Kingdom Hearts 1, Tarzan never appeared again in the Kingdom Hearts series. Many people wonder, why exactly is this? I mean, it does seem strange that both Chain of Memories and Recoded never included Deep Jungle as both of those titles took Sora back through his adventures within the worlds that appeared in Kingdom Hearts 1. Although the reasoning as to why Tarzan never appeared again was never really released by Square Enix or Disney for that matter, there is actually a pretty clear answer that may explain why Tarzan never returned to Kingdom Hearts. So first things first, the Tarzan property is actually owned by Edgar Rice Burroughs. Back in 1999, Disney got permission from Edgar to create an animated feature film about Tarzan. Three years later, Kingdom Hearts 1 released and Tarzan was also included as a visitable world. One thing to keep in mind is that Kingdom Hearts is a Disney game, and Disney themselves has a certain ownership over the franchise. However though, Square Enix still needs to contact Disney and the connected companies to get permission to use these different Disney properties in Kingdom Hearts. You'll notice that when Kingdom Hearts 1 boots up, you'll actually see Edgar Rice Burrow clearly stated there and that the permission to use Tarzan is clearly stated too. This meant that Square Enix had to get in contact with Edgar personally and come up with some deal in order to have Tarzan as a world. What's interesting is Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories was actually going to include Deep Jungle as a world. This beta picture here shows us the world itself. It's very likely that Disney lost the rights to Tarzan here on afterwards. Either that, or perhaps Ica just didn't like the way Tarzan was incorporated in Kingdom Hearts. It looks to be that there was some sort of contractual agreement towards the use of Tarzan property in Kingdom Hearts, and it seems like the use of the property was extremely limited. Personally, I feel like if Square Enix wanted Tarzan back in Kingdom Hearts, they could probably make something happen. However, we also have to look at the fact that the world itself wasn't really that popular to begin with, and same even goes with the movie in comparison to so many other Disney films. I honestly think that Square has just let Tarzan be, but that's not to say it's totally impossible for Tarzan to return. Square Enix literally have to go through so much work and effort in order to get all of these different Disney properties to be inside of the different Kingdom Hearts games, and it does take a lot of time. I suppose Square Enix has just thought to themselves that it's not entirely worth it going out of their way to of course try extremely hard to get Tarzan back. Although I didn't exactly enjoy the world in Kingdom Hearts 1 due to it being one of the most annoying and hard to navigate worlds in all of the Kingdom Hearts games, I can't help but feel that a second chance at a Tarzan world with the next generation of Kingdom Hearts would actually be awesome. In conclusion, it seems that Disney and Square Enix had a limited time contract with the rights and they just simply ran out. We'll never actually know the full story unless Disney or Square Enix speak out publicly.